All right, well, here I am cleaning my AR-15. I've got the bolt receiver out. And it kind of dawned on me that there was something that, <clears throat> that it was pointed out to me um, a while back to, to look for while you're uh, cleaning the, re, um, the bolt carrier assembly for your AR-15. So I've already got it kind of torn apart here. It's kind of, I was going to tear it apart and videotape while I tore it apart, but um, it's kind of hard to do when you're one hand, doing it out of this one-handed. So there's your, uh, there's your firing pin. There's the uh, pin that holds basically everything together. So this slides in here. And it all fits together. That pin will go it will go in there. This cotter pin here will go in there. Anyway, you get the idea. But anyway, something I wanted to point out is once you get all this thing apart and cleaning and everything like that, something to watch for. Trying to do this where you can see it. It's kind of hard because this is my cell phone. But uh, you'll get carbon buildup all around here. And when I first got this, I was a little naive as far as how to clean this thing until I got had somebody show me. But uh, you'll get carbon buildup around there. And sometimes you'll get an extreme amount as to, you know, if you leave it on there, you'll have to uh, take something and scrape it off, but you have to be ultra careful not to damage uh, not to damage this when you're cleaning it. But yeah, you gotta be real careful um, not to let carbon build up there because it'll, it'll cause you problems in the long run. And second, I don't know how well you can see this on here. It gets kind of blurry when I get close, but on on this little ring assembly in here, there's these little, there's these like three little rings, and they have notches in them. And I, I'm not sure if, let me try that, if you can see them or not. But you might be able to see them. But there's these little tiny notches in there. And uh, if you get all three, like even two or three of the notches line up, um, it won't block the gas. It'll it'll let gas come through, and your, and your gun will misfire. You'll have problems with it. So these little tiny little notches, something to look for. And I've got two right here. I don't think you can see it very well, but I've got two here that are are getting close to being lined up. So I need to move them. But and there's the third, if you can see it. These little tiny black notches here. Like I said, this is on my on my phone, so it gets a little fuzzy when I get close to it, but hopefully you get the general idea what I'm, what I'm looking for, because that was something I never noticed before, and I started having um, issues, and when I pulled it out, a friend of mine who's a Marine, he uh very knowledgeable with this kind of thing, pointed out that, they, uh, that those little notches were all getting lined up, or pretty damn close to being lined up, and that was causing the, the malfunction with the gun, so... Anyway, um, something to look for, something kind of sparked my, uh, uh, sparked a thought there for you to uh, consider when you're cleaning your AR-15, if you have one. Um, just thought it would be a helpful, full, uh, helpful tip. Anyway, this is uh, Nick signing off. See you later.